In today's video, we are establishing a communication between two ESP8266 using the uh, protocol uh, ESP now. One of the uh, ESP8266 uh, will be our transmitter, the sender, and the other the uh, receiver the sender or transmitter needs to know the media access control address aka mac address so that uh, uh, he can send uh, the uh, data or so that uh, the uh, the communication may be established to know the mac address of the receiver is is very simple by uploading uh, any code you will uh, see the mac address of the uh, receiver on the uh, output uh. we can use this sketch we will be using uh, a push button which will be connected to the uh, sender so that uh, when we push the button the sender will be sending the data so that uh, an LED um, might turn off that is wrong don't listen to him correct is so that uh, the uh, led might turn on and when we release the button the uh, led part of the uh, receiver will be turned off we're gonna be using a pull down r resistor connected to the uh, pin D0 through our push button. On the uh, receiver side, we're going to be connecting the uh, LED to pin D1, and uh, we also need a resistor that uh, we're going to be connecting to the uh, cathode of the LED, uh, other leg to ground so now i think we can go to uh, arduino id so that uh, we can establish the communication okay that's our program okay guys uh, so but first of all you need to include uh, these libraries uh, so you do that by by including by putting by go to preferences and uh, you uh, gotta include the um, ESP8266 link I've already done uh, made a, a video about that okay then you go to boards and uh, you search for ESP8266. Okay. Uh, so that's the, uh, the uh, uh, LED. That's the receiver, okay, code LED to D1. And uh, here, so we are creating a tap dev extractor. In state is our member variable so here we are creating a variable of type extract messenger so here we are re receiving the data okay the mac address uh, so the uh, income data and uh, the uh, length of the uh, uh, the data that uh, the um, transmitter is sending okay 
Um, so now we go to so this function okay we use it to cap a block of memory from a source okay transmitter location to a de a uh, destination um we we which is the uh, receiver code okay that's the uh, receiver code so my data is a pointer to the uh, destination memory location where the uh, data will be capped okay the data co coming from the uh, transmitter the source and uh, the uh, income data income data is the uh, is uh, it is also a pointer to the source so the uh, income data is the uh, is a pointer to the source me memory location from where the data um, will be capped okay guys so um, the data c coming from the uh, transmitter will be capped okay and that the uh, size of of course we uh, we want to know the size of the uh, incoming data so here the state member is accessing the uh, data okay my, my data coming from the uh, transmitter okay the state and um, if so after transmitting okay after um uh, after that if the uh, my data is one so the uh, LED t t turns on, on if that uh, my data is uh, zero the uh, LED turns off so light beam is our uh, 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 LED and uh, it an output so that's the function that um, allows the uh, receiver code to work okay guys that's the uh, re receiver code okay guys don't forget that so now we go to the uh, boards and uh, we pick our boards okay the one and uh, after so we, we pick that and after picking the board we go to pick the uh, the com okay com seven and and then we uploaded a sketch so it will take few time if you want okay as i said guys uh we need to know the mac address of the receiver code that's why i'm in, i'm uploading the code first because in the uh output by looking at the uh, output okay of the uh, of the sketch okay uh, of this uh, upload we can know the uh, mark address of the board okay that's the that's the uh, mark address okay you cap that so you 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 uh, you don't need any program to know the mark address so so you cap that and, and you you paste that here like that okay that's the uh, sender uh, code okay now we are in the sender code so you need the uh, to broadcast the address okay the mic address of the transmitter and here is the same okay the push bu button is attached to pin D0 of the uh, transmitter, okay? So we are creating also a type def uh, structure, okay? And uh, so um, that's the me member state. And uh, here we are creating a, a variable of type extract a message okay and so if the transmitter the transmitter is successful it will uh, print out 
the message delivery success if, if not delivery fail okay guys um, now here here is the state okay so here the state member will give okay one to my data okay variable if the push button is one and the my data variable okay the one the, the data will be sent by this uh function okay s now send okay now we can go to board and uh go to yeah Look, uh, pick the board, the right board, and uh, con 12. We can upload the the, um, the transmitter or sender sketch. I guess it it will take few moments, and yeah, it will upload. It's uploading. Okay, so you can also know the uh, MAC address of the uh, transmitter. That's the uh, MAC, okay. Um, and uh, in the output, we, uh, we can see the delivery success. So that's our receiver. And uh, that's our transmitter uh, build. So if I press that button, the LED turns on. That means that uh, the uh, ESP now protocol is sending one to the receiver. Okay, and the receiver turns on, uh, gives uh, one to the uh, pin D1. Then the uh, LED turns on. If I release the button, the uh, ESP now protocol through uh, media access control is sending zero, okay, uh, low to this, uh, this receiver and uh, the LED turns on. Off. Okay. So 